Welcome everybody back to the channel. We're back this morning on uh, my hometown lake. It's a Friday. Had an early work day today. I got kind of like a busy schedule today, but most of it is like aimed towards the evening time. So I decided to come down to my little local lake, fish for some largemouth. Um, it's November, you know, it's fall time. It's fall time. It's on that cusp of being winter time. Um, so I'm hoping that the largemouth cooperate today and um, we can catch some really nice, good quality fish. Don't really know, hadn't been here in a long time, uh, but we're gonna give it a try. One thing about today is it's very, very windy. Um, I don't think the actual overall um, wind is real high. I think it's like maybe 17, 18 miles per hour. But you know, on some of these days, you have what they consider more of a gust. You know, some days it may gust every, you know, five minutes, you know, the wind pick up, then it slows down. Uh, but today is more one of those gusting days where it's gusting more than it's slowing down. So it's a pretty consistent, um, you know, 17 mile per hour wind. And, you know, I'm fishing that Pelican Bass Radar. I don't, I don't wait for the wind to get right. You know, if I did that, I'd never, I never get the fish, so um, we're gonna go on ahead and get onto this water. Coming to the boat. Caught him coming back to the boat. All right. All right. That's the first one of the day. Yeah. Caught him off of one of the cheapest bladed jigs I've seen on market. Um, it's called a humdinger. I think it's made by, uh, I can't remember who it's made by, but uh, I think it's Zap something, but uh, it's a humdinger. And that's a nice bass. Nice large mouth. Let's get him back in. Caught him. Just coming straight to the boat. I'm just winding in. Boom, he come up and grab it. Felt good to catch that one.
right at by eight something you know because that bad boy had a big mouth on him and it took me forever to get that bladed jig out of him it was it was engaged in him pretty pretty deep but not deep but you know it was in him good you know in the roof of his mouth real good so it took me a minute to get it out um but the other one i caught on the um on a little cheap yum yum uh yum well i'll put the name of the the uh, actual bladed G at the bottom in the description um, that I switched out to an Evo and caught my other one um, but I did have one um, as I was winding in come up right as I got it to the boat and I kind of like let the, the lure rest in the rest in the water beside the boat and I reached down real fast to get something and just like that bam you know what I'm saying <laughs> something hit it and all I could see was just a flash of it. It was a pretty good size. Um, but with that being said, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to get on out of here. I got to get to this football game. Go Wolverines. Playoff time. And um, I'll holler at you to that last one of y'all on the next one.